Hey guys, how's it going? Tower Aaron's Rock 50 here, and we're back with Balloons TV Battles. What's this episode about? The eight freaking new maps that came into battles. Let's see what this one. Battle Park. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. I remember, I remember this one from uh, iOS. The heck? What towers do I want to choose? Um, shoot. Hurry. Uh, there. <laughs> I don't know. Probably a bad choice. Maybe I should have picked like uh, eighth instead. But I don't know. So anyways, new map here. This one's Battle Park. It's actually pretty easy. I don't know why, but whenever I look at it, I keep seeing Battle Panic. Like, no, it's Battle Park, that's for sure. But, uh, yeah, whatever. So, um, yeah, two baths that kind of merges up here and they go around like this. Decent spot for boats, but I don't really use boats. This spot right in the middle here should be pretty good for attack shooters, especially since balloons pass by it twice, which is twice the opportunity to get tons of pops in. And I'm pretty sure you can only fit it here if you're in low quality, but I have no idea. I believe I was able to fit, like, monkey wizards in here while playing on iOS before, so I mean, I don't know. But, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna kind of go through as many maps as I can, try to make up strategies as I go or something, and just have a ton of fun, because why not? Because battles is pretty fun. Ah, uh, an ice tower. I've actually seen quite a bit of ice towers lately, so apparently, apparently the mortar ice tower combo is good or something. I don't know. I probably should have picked uh, Village myself, because Mortars don't exactly work well with Tax Shooters. Just because they cause Balloons to regrow a bit extra. But I should be fine. I hope. Also, I'm I'm not going to get this super range tax right away. But I'm hoping that the Tax Shooter can actually hit up here and down here, because then it'd be super epic. And it looks like this guy's going to be weak to pinks. Like, I'm calling it out already. He's going to have pink problems. Let's see. I'm going to get you here right here have you on close and i'll send like pink and then blues and that kind of stuff so yeah he's gonna try to send some pinks but little does he know three zero tech shoes are great against pinks yeah buddy buddy boy buddy buddy and this spot works out pretty well i imagine you've been scared every single time a balloon comes from up here around it's like holy crap holy crap okay <sighs> breathe holy crap holy breathe so yeah that, that's me let's see 519 this 2500 okay so i need to get like two thousand dollars to get ring of fire because you usually want that before round six so i'm gonna send him a bunch of pink balloons to make him like spaz out and stuff and make all his towers suck oh now you get the upgraded boom ranger now you do okay i see how it is he was saving that for a while i guess so let's see was this the guy I played in the update video? I don't think so. I think they just both had high records. So anyways, I should definitely uh, be able to sell this bomb tower very soon. Next, the economy boost, I believe. And then I can get my ring of fire. Oh, shoot. No. Uh, not quite. There we go. Now I can. So I somehow simultaneously bought both upgrades. I don't know how that happened. <laughs> I, I, like, pressed uh, the hotkey for, like, the uh, space... Or no... Uh, what is it? There's a period and a comma. The period and the comma are the hotkeys for upgrades. And I apparently pressed them both as at once, so I got them both. And I kind of forgot. Look at where the ring of fire is stopping. It's actually stopping before it gets to the edge of its range. And I don't think it actually fulfills the range of the super range tax. So yeah, super range tax are only... Well, it's no improvement. It literally does nothing to the tower. So, yeah, that's kind of sad. Poor tax shooter. Shoot, I wonder... Huh. I hope regrow whites don't make this suck. Because I guess that could be kind of bad. Because it would only pop like them down to green tier that they could come around. Nah, I think it'll manage. This guy probably isn't experienced enough to send regrow whites anyways. And when I say experienced enough, I don't mean... Oh boy. Actually, no. Where was I going with this? I, I, I'm pretty sure he's experienced, but I don't think he's like the world's greatest player. Because he played like over 3,000 games when I uh, came into quick battles with him. I mean, I guess that means his experience. But he used some kind of mortar starting. He's spamming Bionic Boomer Rangers. I don't think Bionic Boomer got nerfed in um, battles. It only got nerfed in Bloons Monkey City, so it's only worse there. At least I hope. But I don't know for sure. Anyways, 2-3 mortar. I'm going to try this spot. I'm curious if this is, like, enough to cover all the pinks and stuff. Because I'm pretty sure his spot is, and he's going to be weak to, like, some pinks. And also, I'm going to get a bomb tower right here for cleanup. And now, a couple of these. 
And yeah, let's give Bomb Tower up to like 3 1. Yeah, there we go. His spot ain't good enough. You gonna leak, son. You gonna leak, and you gonna keep leaking whether you like it or not. <laughs> That's right. I'm gonna make you leak. Doesn't it sound bad? Like you're just beating someone like leak, leak, leak. I'm trying, but it hurts. And that actually sounds pretty bad. Whoa. Oh, sweet. The apprentices have the freaking cool lightning here. I love this lightning graphic. It looks so badass. It's like more thicker lightning. It's more gooder. And also, because ceramics come next round, let's get our three zero uh, attack shooters. Because, I mean, those guys do good against ceramics. Oh, I can't fit one more. Come on, I just want to fit one more. How about up here? Uh, maybe over here? I don't know. This, this spot's a bit risky. Oh, he's going for ceramics. Um, okay, so let's see how I do against them. Oh, yeah. No troubles whatsoever. Eh... Uh, Maybe not whatsoever, but I mean, like, no troubles. I actually got a second ring of fire. I should be getting more economy. I actually don't even think I need it. The bomb was doing good with cleanup and all that. I really didn't need a second fire, ring of fire, but, I mean, why not? I would definitely rather have one than not have one. I might end up selling this... Yeah, no, I'm not going to sell them. At least, not yet. Also, can you... Yes, I got into attack out there. That's good. One extra layer of damage right there. That That's very good. So I'm going to get some, like, Moab Maulers and stuff, so, uh, I can actually hold off Moabs, uh, right about here, uh, just 0 three ones because they're slightly more cost-effective against groups of Moabs than, um, 2 threes are. I mean, I know at round 18, only space Moabs come out, so 2 threes will be a bit better, but I'm thinking in the long run, guys. Speaking of thinking in the long run, why don't you have, like, any ceramic popping power? What am I doing? I'm like... Oh yeah, I should be doing this, that, that. Well, I should notice that your ceramic uh, defense sucks. Oh uh, yep, and there goes a whole ceramic. And once this, once these guys start going through, he's not gonna stand much a chance. He's buying extra. Oh, he's buying extra boomerangers in the back. Um. All right, now you have no more popping power. So I will take care of that for you. Say goodbye to your life very shortly. And I'm gonna mix in some uh, fast cooldown ceramics here. Because why not? Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, hurry up. Oh, he's going for a rush against me. I might get like a blade maelstrom if I have to. Oh, and I don't even have to. My guys wrecked, wrecked the, that ceramic rush. Sweetness. No defense needed. And he's screwed to the mob. Mm, bye, dude. Goodbye. And there we go. That's game. Let's see what other ma new maps there are. On to the next game. Alright guys, here we are. We found another map. What's this one? Zen Garden. Huh. I have no idea how it goes though. That's the thing. Like, I see the stuff and uh, I, I don't know. Well, bomb towers are definitely a go-to. I see water, so I'm gonna go with boats. Um, what else? Freaking village. Let's go with the farm. I don't... Actually, this loadout sucks. <laughs> Crap, whatever. I don't know why I'm doing that on this map. I don't even know how it goes. So, I mean, I'm just going to watch. I'm going to possibly figure it out. But up against Harrykins or something like that. And we'll see if this works. So, <laughs> if this is like a two-map thing. <clears throat> hey, uh, this would be, uh, be kind of interesting. I wouldn't be surprised if it was like one path for balloons and then one for towers I mean no no one path for computer balloons and then one path for our balloons and I don't know I mean I'm just throwing out the boat just because I'm so used to b boats in balloons monkey city I don't know why but I've just really been loving boats oh my gosh wait so they come up here it'd be nice if they came up here instead yep and I'm s eating eating the poo poo right now so I'm gonna probably get like a bomb shooter maybe here Let's go right here. Even though it's like not in the corner or something, I believe it should be able to hit a little bit on this this path too. So it's like a combined effort. Oh, so this is, this is going to be tough. <laughs> this is going to be a tough map. And this is actually going to be pretty fun. I can see this map being quite the amount of fun. How are we going to manage pinks on it though? That's the issue. I should have picked uh, better towers, I suppose. Maybe something faster like... Oh, I should have picked a tax here. That's what I should have done. Tax here, maybe instead like boats or something. And I'm gotta save up for a 3 0 cannon, otherwise you're screwed. Or otherwise I'm screwed. I'm gonna sell you so I can get you. Um, don't know if this will do me any good though. How is he against pinks? Huh. 
That's not a bad spot, but he's still leaking lives. Even on last, that's not going to do him too much good. Um, and I'm kind of screwed against pinks as well. Unless if I can like work some kind of magic right here. I got my boat shooting down the straight line. Holy crap, he's at 18 lives. When is this happening? He's losing so much. 2-3 Boomeranger just isn't quite the way to go. But my setup is not good either. I should probably be harassing him more because he's like so close to going down so close but yet so far just keep saving me cannon and bow combo and there we go so yeah i'm gonna have to do a lot more work on this map this one is gonna be a challenge like holy crap guys i made like a ton of uh videos on uh hydro dam strategies because that map was tough the first time but this map is like balls to the wall what the hell insane all right see you guys in the next game with another new map Alright guys, we're back, we got another new map here, third one, Ice Flow, and this time I'll maybe pick better tower choices, I'm gonna try this, this combination, see if this works out, this, is, this one should favor boats a bit more, also, for short maps, Monkey Buccaneer Takedown is a must have. <laughs> Welp, yeah, I, I saw his uh, record, he, he's kind of a new player, but hey, I've never played this map before, so we're both kind of disadvantaged. Um, what do I want to do? Uh, I'm going to start with the Boomer Ranger right here, then Bomb Tower right about here. It's so normal Boomer Bomb Stars, and I feel if I have this guy on last, I can have him shoot down this line and have him do a decent job. So, I mean, I'll have you on last, and then I'll slowly get you up to 2-3. So, that's, that's my idea. Oh! Crap! Okay, so the nat- Oh, shoot, the natural balloons and the, uh... Computer sent balloons come in different areas. That's gonna be that's gonna be quite some fun. All right, um, sack that boomeranger for now. I don't know of any good spots at this point. Then, and I'll get a three zero cannon right in the middle. I might as well just do that. I can even sell you too. So much selling and stuff, and I'll just save up for cluster bombs. Yeah, these guys cluster bombs. He looks pretty set right now. It's Oh, it's, I didn't realize it's at, at the same spot where I put mine. So let's see how this guy does against pinks. Yep, bad. Okay, so I, I require more defense. Otherwise, I'm boned. So what, what do I get? Oh, nope, he stopped. Uh, okay, I guess he's being a nice person, I guess. Um, all right, let's get a freaking boat or something. I don't know. I'm going to get Grape Shot, though, just because it has a pretty nice spread. I feel it could do well on this map. Yeah, it seems to clean up pretty nicely, actually. Uh, I'm liking this great grape shot. Grape him. Yeah, grape him. How's this guy against blacks? I don't know. If I, if I do some kind of blue, then black layering, I could probably get some uh, lives on him. Uh, otherwise, probably not so much. Maybe I'll get, like, uh, two... Let's see, two of these boats and put them each on strong. I'll just have you on strong as well. And I can kind of have, like, some kind of boat party or something yeah boat party i feel boats and uh, bombs in combination might not work out too bad but then i'll need to have some help with like mortars and uh boomerangers and stuff eventually so let's try a bit of this layering see if it works at all oh oh hey it worked there we go we got a black through it did actually happen to his screen though let's see if he loses some lives yeah well actually no that's there it is there we go full black got through that time so my layering is working believe it or not guys Blacks do not overlap with greens, um, just because they go at exactly the same spa pace. Oh dang, he got a destroyer now, so that's kind of worthless at this point. I'll have you on strong still. I'm going to get Grape Shot on you, so I can be set. And I feel with both those guys on strong, I should be able to get most of the blacks, but I mean, I don't know for sure. I could have some kind of strange curveball come my way, so that wouldn't be fun. Um, one, two, three, four. One, two, three. So I'm gonna try this. Nope, never mind. No hope in that. He's trying to send some regal yells. I don't think so. I'm pretty sure my mom will keep me safe for now. And holy crap, round nine already. So this is quite the short map. I don't know. I'm gonna have to work out some kind of magic for this map. Maybe tax shooters will work on here too. I mean, I know Blade Maelstrom's a freaking lifesaver, but I mean, I'm not quite sure if I trust myself against like ceramics with tax shooters though. So I'm going to get this uh, signal flare and all that. I'm actually just going to go 1-3. Well, yeah, I'm going to get a 1-3 mortar. Then I'm going to have this uh, crow's nest kind of clean up. Um, Yeah, since this won't get, like, all the pinks, but it'll get, like, most of every other balloon. 
all I really need to do is just have like a regular 2-2 uh, two -two boat here otherwise. Now what do I want to get? I probably want to get a ricochet uh, in order to like pop a bunch of regular rainbows and stuff. Where can I fit it? How about up here? Yeah, up here should work. So it's kind of similar to Hydro Dam. What's he got? He, all right, he has a solid D right now. I'm not gonna touch it or anything. I'm not. I'm just gonna let it lay there or whatever. Up, oh, up. Oh, <laughs> nice try. Even if you do manage to sneak pink, pink spat past, I shan't be stopped. What are you doing, space rim? Oh, he, he was. He, I think he wants to send a, a, re a regular, a regular brush, but he's not doing it because I don't know. Uh, so you don't know why. I should probably get up some uh, ceramic uh, detection. And by ceramic detection, I mean like crap tons of grape shots. Yes, I know. Crap tons of grape shots definitely seems crazy, but I don't know. <laughs> maybe maybe it'll work. I don't know. I'm hoping it does. But he is definitely going to be very, very weak against ceramics. Let's give this a try. And ceramic. Let's see what he can do to it. And, okay, yeah, actually, never mind. I'm going to need more than one ceramic if I want to do damage. Wait. Oh, dang. I was hoping by way too, if I said way too, lose a couple lives. Well, let's try some more ceramics. Maybe the more the merrier. And sell even a boat here or there. And just get this going. Because there's no way he's going to be able to hold off all the ceramics, right? Right? Oh, yeah, he's screwed. That is going to be game. Sweet. So this, <laughs> this map's also going to be pretty fun. This one actually seems a bit more balanced. Because... You know, you kind of have to use boats, but you don't absolutely have to. There's, like, no good spots for other towers. Also, I'm pretty sure this map is based off of, um, that ice map in, uh, Bloons TD5, uh, mobile. I don't know if it came to a computer yet. I know BTD5 just got, like, eight, five new maps or something like that. I was gonna say eight, but no, Battles got eight new maps. <laughs> That's what I'm doing right now. BTD5 got five. So, anyways, I think I'll go for one more game since these have been relatively short. And I'll catch you guys on the other side. Alright guys, here we're uh, back with our fourth map. What is this? Volcano. Or Volcano, if you prefer to uh, pronounce it differently than I. Well, this seems like an interesting map. What should I go with? Uh, should I just go with the standard loadout that's like good for m pretty much everything? Sure, why not? This is pretty much the safe loadout that's like, you know, you're not going to super late game, but you'll get, be good against, like, all early and middle round stuff, except the maps that are, like, primarily water. But what is this? So this is a volcano, and I see a couple different entrances. It looks like over there is, like, different entrances for balloons you send and balloons your opponent can send. Also, I could have sworn there was, like, an area in the middle that's, like, uh, you could, I don't know. I don't know that you could possibly uh, put like a boat or something in the middle. I don't care if I leak those couple lives. I'm gonna go for a. Oh, hmm. Let's see. Any good spots? I'm gonna send a balloon. See if these come out in a different area. Okay, so they do. They do come out in a different area. Hmm. Let's see. How well is this spot hook? It's good. It's better against uh, regular balloons, though, than pinks. Hmm. I'm trying to figure out if there are any good, like, uh, two or three boom ranger spots on this map. Because, uh, I mean, I guess... Oh, wait. These come around a totally different way. Oh, shoot. And it looks like they kind of loop around like that. Intervesting. Intervesting indeed, actually. So, the regular uh, computers, or your sense balloons, actually loop around twice. In this little water area. He's got a ricochet. Doesn't seem like too bad an idea. I got a 3-0 bomb. Let's see how it does against pinks. And also let's see how his does against pinks. Hmm. So I, I'm, I'm trying to think. What would be good for that? Would it, a mortar even work on this map? I guess I mean if I aimed it here. It could do me some good. I don't know. Did I send him pinks? I wasn't watching. I should actually watch this time. See how the pinks do. He probably held him off pretty well. Because Glaive Ricochet is good in battles as long as it doesn't whiffs whiff and also i mean the balloons loop twice around so i'm trying to yeah <laughs> they do also when they, when they come out of here do they go on a different path or something i mean i don't know anyways oh yep they come around this way and it looks like my three zero cannons actually sucking like a lot right now so his three zero boomeranger start worked a lot better than my three zero cannon start so i'm gonna sell you for you <laughs> perfect yeah i mean so <laughs> 
Innovation, apparently. Oh, wait. Shoot, he had his up here and I have mine down here. Let's see if... I hope it doesn't make a difference. I don't think it will. I don't think so. Will it be good against blacks, too? Because if I can hold off against blacks, I would be a very, very happy Tyler right now. If not, I'd probably get, like, a attack shooter or something just to kind of weaken them a little bit. So we'll test it by sending them against him, and then we'll see how he does and react appropriately. So these blacks... Eh, eh, um, not so much. Oh, he is a ninja for backup. That's an interesting tower choice. Very interesting indeed. I'm gonna go with you right here. Wait, whoa, okay. So, yeah, his boomeranger spot's a ton better than mine. I actually don't like this tax shooter spot either. I'm gonna try here, maybe, instead. Nope, I just continue to leak, like, over and over again. Uh, the, the ricochet is just not bouncing where I want it to. And he's getting so many lives on me with these blacks. I'm not just not doing well. Seems that his boomer ninja combo works pretty well. Should I be safe against uh, regrow balloons? I don't know. Like, regrow whites? Not quite sure. I'm gonna try that against him. Maybe it'll overwhelm his ninja in the back or something. I don't know. I honestly don't. None of this really makes sense to me still. Uh, no, it looks like he's good against Regrow White. Oh, wait, no, no, his Boomeranger spot is the same as mine. But yet, somehow, his worked, like, a crap ton better against the Blacks than mine did. Mine did. Okay. Maybe the Ninja just was, like, super important or something, I just didn't realize. Maybe. Highly unlikely, but maybe. Also, I somehow managed to fit a bomb tower in there. It's hard to tell, like, what where you, where the track even is, because all that smoke and stuff. It's just covering the place up. I can't see anything. I guess that means it's economy time. Whoop, whoop, economy. Yes. All right, so this is actually a pretty interesting map. The, like, the balloons you send and the natural balloons, like, you know, they come in the same general areas, but they have, like, different parts of overlap. Also, I probably got way too greedy, and I'm not going to be able to afford my uh, camo detection now, unless I sell this tax shooter or something. Which I will end up doing, by the way. I am going to sell you and get you there, and hopefully this will be good enough. Uh, where is he aiming his? I'm going to try a couple of camo pinks there, just f for size, I suppose. Oh, he does have a ninja in the back, though, to save himself. So, I mean, nothing to worry about there. Um, so let's see. If, like, a m massive regrowing brush comes, if you decide to send that, I'm definitely going to go for uh, Blade Maelstrom, just because. Or I could get a Ring of Fire. It'd be really cool if you could place it here. Like, this would be the OP spot for a Ring of Fire. But it doesn't seem that tax years would have too much of purpose on, or uh, usefulness on this map. Ninjas might actually work well, because they are good against ceramics. But maybe, just maybe, I'll go for, like, a couple tax sprayers to strip down the ceramic layer, because I don't know what else to do. Uh, one, two, and I'll get a Bionic Boomeranger, because why not? Here, put him on strong. This isn't even a good spot or anything. I'm just putting him there, just because. So, yeah, now we sit and we wait. <laughs> huh. Hmm. I don't know, what would be good for this map? Like, mortar spam or something? Because, I mean, you know, mortars are good with, like, their giant rate, you know, circular explosion, which is, like, perfect for this map. Also, we're dropping a couple frames. Don't know how that's happening. But, yeah, I'm just trying to think. Could we get anything on him? Hmm, I'm, I don't care for that Boomeranger, uh, Bionic Boomer spot he has. Even though he does have, like, a ton of backup, I don't see him doing too well against our Amex. So I'm going to send, like, three of them real soon. Or four. Make that four. And let's find out. How does he do? Oh, uh, well, it causes him to drop frames, that's for sure. And it looks like he does fine just because he has, like, so much cluster damage there in the back. That seems to be his saving grace right now. So, now what? I think we require more mods. Oh, he's going for ceramics against me. Okay, I see how it is. Yeah, no, I, I definitely have enough cleanup for sure. Like, no chance he's getting that by me. I'm going to have the Moai Maul right here, because just so it doesn't get, like, cock-blocked by the natural balloons. If it, if I put it here, it would try to shoot the Moai up here, but then it only hit these natural balloons that came in here. Or the AI balloons, I guess. And I'd get cock-blocked. But we get a really nice uh, economy on this map. 944. Okay, so I guess this is a decent strategy. I, tax sprayers also do good damage to Moab, so I think I'm kind of safe for now. Might get you up might get like, I don't know, 
maybe a ring ring of fire I, I don't know in all honesty what the heck should i do i'm just sitting here i'm waiting looking to see if i can get any sort of weakness on him i don't think i will be able to although i want to try something real quick like i know this isn't going to work but i want to see if he like causes them to regrow or anything like in just 10 million balloons and then oh shoot well it was terrible timing on my part but that really lags, so maybe that means he made a lot of balloons? I don't know. Oh wait, mortal exploits are kind of useless here because he has this ninja. Duh. I'm dumb. Don't mind me. I'm just being dumb. Dumb old tower. So let's see, I'm going to get you. Let's get this up. And hopefully we have enough splash damage in the back now. If I have to, blade maelstrom, but that's only if I have to. I think I should be fine otherwise. Although popping ceramics might be kind of tough. <laughs> I don't know. I honestly don't. I'm going to try Rigro BFB against him next time I get the chance. Or maybe even a cluster of them. I don't know. Um, but very shortly, as soon as I can afford it, I'm going to send him a Rigro BFB. So this actually makes up quite a, you know, quite a few good maps. Uh, we're seeing some good options for like, you know, King of the Hill type gameplay and stuff. And competitive battles i might get back to that if i'm interested i might it, it'll just take a while so anyways here it is he has a freaking balloon jitsu in front i guess he was like saving himself or something i don't know here comes some fast going moabs on my part let's see if i can do any damage with him them and overall just see if i can totally own him come on let's get let's go destroy him just so many balloons coming here in here just destroy him go by and like finish him that's gonna be game right there all those going through and we got him there we go <laughs> bfb and moab combo whoopee for the win so yeah four different maps this a game this was only four of the eight new maps i've actually looked at them all just by creating a private battle and just looking at the icons of them. But this is my first time actually playing these maps so yeah, pretty cool. I'm glad to actually try out the new apps and actually make a video about them for you guys. I hope you all enjoyed. Uh, let me know if you want to see the last four maps separate, a separated video or if not for any reason. I don't know. But uh, I thought I thought it's a pretty good video. I hope you enjoyed. Leave some support, like, comment, whatever. And uh, I'll see you all next time with next installment of Battles.